I just hit a big ass curb over there. Fuck my shit up, like. The entire is flat. I mean, it could have been way worse, but still, like. And then it's the problem, right? For one, that's a motherfucking police officer. For two, <laughs> that ain't no problem. <laughs> uh, so my headlights, as y'all can see, they don't fucking work, bro. All of, all, all of this is daylights. I've been trying, because I don't know if it, I tried. Uh, my bulbs, they work, though. Like, these are not bad bulbs. It's like I was fucking with it, and I tried to see if it was the wiring, and then it came back on. So that's how I know my bulbs is good. So I don't know what the fuck going on with them. So I'm going through the fucking intersection, big ass fucking curb, hit that bitch, go over it, and then all I hear is boom, 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 boom. Um, what the fuck is that? So I pull into that, that Walgreens over there, get out. I'm looking like, damn, I don't see nothing, you know, but I ain't really look at it though. Like I get out, I made sure like my fenders are not on some goofy shit. You know, and then I get back in that bitch, come down, bloom, 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 bloom. I'm what the fuck? Say my tire flat. I'm wow, wow. This shit crazy, boy. Does it fit? Yeah, man, but we still need like a little clearance. So it'll go up to like two or three inches. I got you. Oh, we're going up. Oh, yeah, she's so low. I think I'm going to get this up in this. I don't want to break your spoiler, nigga. I ain't going to lie. That motherfucker is low as hell, bro. Like, I don't even... I never lowered this car. Ever. Hell cap broke, T Money. It's broken. It's done for over with. <laughs> Let me get my thumbnail. You know? Get a couple thumbnails, you know? Yo. Not playing with nobody. <laughs> As y'all can see, man, I got my boy Kevon following me. As y'all seen in that last clip, man, that was days ago. I I hit a curb, right, and I popped my tire, and you know I thought that was it. But me and Kevon just took my tire, my rims off, and turns out my tire is. My rim is bent and cracked. So now we're going to take it to the rim repair shop to get repaired. And that's probably going to take a couple more days. So I'm not going to be driving Cat Baby for a little while. I'm up here at Don's, man. Y'all want to see the damage? Look at this shit. This shit is fucking insane, my nigga. Like. This nigga Kevon cracked his rim too, but he riding on a crack rim. My shit horrible. Like his his shit rideable. You gotta put some JB weld on that shit, boy. Man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's September 6th. I'm leaving my rim right there just to let y'all know. It's right there. Right here. Yeah, right there. Right there. Yeah. The black one. Yeah. Just in case. You feel me? You know them SRT rims and motherfuckers are expensive. And motherfuckers out here is stillers. Thieves. Crooks, whatever you want to fucking call it, every name in the book, they is. Now, I wasn't gonna make a video on this, but I'm gonna make a video on this just because 
for him to be honest. I need to get paid from this shit. My car don't fucking work, gang. Like, I don't understand what's wrong with this motherfucker. This don't work, but I know that's just a little, that's just some little, you know, battery shit. I gotta disconnect, reconnect my battery, so I ain't really tripping on that. But this motherfucker keep excessively dying on me, gang. Like, it, like it's got to the point where I... I'm, I was, like, really, really fucking upset about this shit. Like, nigga, I just went to the gym, right? Nigga, I just went to the gym, right? This bitch died on me. I, I wasn't even at the gym a whole hour, bro. I was in the gym for, like, 45 minutes. Again. I swear to God, this bitch died on me, bro. When I tell you this shit really pissed me off today, like, I can't I can't take it no more. So I'm, I'm turning this motherfucking hand, selling it, I'm getting rid of it, and I'm just going to get a Jeep wagon in. That's what I'm going to do. Gang, my Hellcat is broken. Y'all don't know. <laughs> Look, any y'all done? It's tripping. Right here, it says, where it say it at? Right here. Can't do alignment. Car sits too low. We it's not lowered. Oh, my mama. So look. I went in there, told them it keep dying, all this extra shit. Okay, cool. Y'all might not be able to fix the electrical problem. Something that y'all should be able to do. Right. Y'all might not be able to do that. But a fucking alignment, my nigga, my car not lowered, bro. My car not lowered, bro. Dude, come on now. Come on now. I, shit. An animal could run under that motherfucker. All right, so I figured out my problem on why my car. All right, so let me give y'all a real quick rundown on what happened to my Hellcat. So on the first clip y'all seen, one day I was just tweaking driving home and I couldn't see a certain uh, part of the road and I hit the curb and my I cracked my rim right here and shit i had to get that repaired it was down for a couple days I had to get it towed back and but after that weirdly enough but for a couple months it's been doing this but it got real real bad uh after that it started dying like repetitively like i couldn't leave it for 10 minutes it died on me it, in the rain i need to get it washed like it's filthy right now i need to get it washed it died on me in the rain a couple times it died on me just multiple 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 times so I came here, took it to Ray Chrysler Dodge up here in Fox Lake. They do good work here, and they, they be having some hot cars. They they don't got much, much on the lot. I think they got, like, one scat, a couple scats up here, so come check them out. But um, they do good work as far as service-wise. They got a lot of good SRT technicians. And, uh, um, yeah, so they found out the problem, and they said the problem was a draw from my steering wheel. The steering wheel was drawing the power from something why uh from why it's drawing the power i don't know why i've had this steering wheel on here for probably like a year and a couple months now and i don't understand why it's losing power now but hey you never know we'll figure it out though yeah, all right man so they done got me right if you need also if you need some hot shit come see my boy anthony up here at ray chrysler dodge he sell everything and he also can sell you some hot shit over there at chevy you feel me? C8. You feel me? Whatever, yeah. whatever you want. They got TRXs, yeah. Hellcats. You feel me? You could put a, in a factory order. I don't know if you could get one of them 392, 300s, though. They might also be out. out. They all sold out. 2000, they all sold. We got three coming here. Yep. My boy already sold them all. Every single one of them. So you, you can't get one of them. You feel me? But they done got me right, man. It feel good to do this again. I ain't did this in so long. I, you know how hard it is? You know how bad I felt that I couldn't automatic start my car because this bitch be dying on me? This is some bullshit. I love, hey, good looking, bro, for real. They got me right. So, yeah, man, we finna go. And I'm gonna get all this shit checked out. Yeah, good looking, bro. Good looking. For sure. Because I ain't gonna lie, a lot of people don't notice that shit. My calibers say you, my YouTube name on it. My They dirty right now, but they say my YouTube name on it if you don't know, bro. So. The little details, it matters. Hey, feel good to be back on this lake. <sighs> I had to unplug my steering wheel. This bitch just regular, regular steering wheel now. <laughs>